use this three-headed rushing attack to get easy yards up the middle, off to the right, and off to the left. Coming up next. Hey, this is Full Game Prometheus, the only YouTuber that shows you full games of all the tips and schemes I post on my channel. I'll show you the good, the bad, and the ugly. So guys, if you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe button. Also, that notification icon so you can never miss an upload. So once again, still back in the Carolina Panthers playbook, and I jumped into uh, the Pistol Strong. I wanted to try to complement uh, the weak formation, which I built out a scheme with, uh, and in the Pistol Strong. And what's cool about this particular play is that it, uh, this formation, is that we're going to run pretty much everything stock uh, from play action um, deep in uh, double flares uh, also the play action boot uh, left we're going to leave all the plays stock including the halfback zone and this this particular formation gives you a very effective running attack where you can attack your opponent up the middle off to the left and off to the right and i'll show you how basically how easy it is to run this running scheme and you can just grind out yards against your opponent especially in that four a four minute situation where you want to go ahead and win a game and it's going to be very difficult for them to stop so we're going to run against random 43s i don't know what the cpu is going to use and we're just going to go ahead and uh run the ball you can basically go ahead and just use uh, the um, uh, fullback situation so what I do is actually put both my running backs so I've got uh, basically uh, uh, my running back uh, which is uh, my running back from Pittsburgh and then Gurley in my fullback position uh, LeVon Bell from uh, from Pittsburgh and all I'm going to do is just go ahead and hold the X button and just watch my blocks and actually go ahead and take a read right there so the cutback was there I didn't make it correctly, but uh, what's going to happen is you're going to see these cutback opportunities where I can pick up a good 5 or 10 yards. And sometimes what's going to happen is you're going to get seal blocking off the off the edge, too, where it's going to come to you. So I assure you that this is a very good running play. And as long as you hold the X button, it gives you an opportunity to go and get these cutbacks against your, against your run fits. Sometimes if you've got an opponent that brings down a safety into the box to go ahead and take away that run, you can go ahead and run off to the right. And one of the adjustments I like to do is I like to go ahead and, and put, the, uh, put the ID to mic off the edge. And that allows me to go ahead and get a little bit better seal right there. So as you can see there, I picked up a good three yards with him actually putting a very aggressive uh, run in there. But a lot of the action is going to be with this particular inside run by the fullback slash uh, dual halfback uh, set. That's where all your action is going to be at. So, so if he's got the line stacked, all we have to do is just go ahead and switch into halfback zone. And I like to ID the mic off the edge. That just gives me a little bit more uh, more comfort. And you can see I can go ahead and run off to the right, and protect, particularly out to the outside too. So this is a really good play to go and jump into. Another play I like to use, um, the play action deep in and play action boot um, left are pretty cool. But the double flares I think is a little bit more consistent, easier to make reads. Um, you basically have got uh, flare routes that you can go and throw to and you're going to force your opponent to go ahead and defend uh, against those flare routes. And if he actually uses some kind of a man blitz, which he might force to do this to stop the run, uh, what's going to happen is this deep, this little comeback route actually will be a nice easy completion for you too. So that's another area, you can, area of the field. And then obviously you have um, off to the right, you've got a table by the running back or the fullback, and then you've got a corner over here by the tight end. So that's, you know, the table with a corner is always one of the one of the most difficult things to actually stop. And then you have a nice little deep uh, post route that you can go ahead and attack your opponent with right there. So good play by the defensive back, just bad pass. It should have been laid, let out a little bit further. So this is another really good play to go and jump into. And let's see if we can get that. Thank you. Thank you for throwing the ball correctly. So guys, this is uh, just a little uh, a little mini scheme that we use. Really, it's more for running the ball. Um, I want to go ahead and actually try to establish the run. And uh, because of the way the blocking works, it gets it gets nice little seals where you can pick up some easy yards, and it's very annoying for your opponent to stop. So if you guys like these type of tips. Make sure you smash the like button, and once again, I'll be rolling out some more little mini schemes and offensive schemes up next.